start with the white wire magic ring. Hook ACH. Thread the needle through the loop, bringing the thread out of the winding. Threading out one coil at a time. This is ACH. Next, hook the first loop. Start with a single crochet. Thread the needle through the loop, bringing the thread out. Winding thread through both loops on the crochet hook at once. This is ASC. Mark the straight S of the first SC with the deduction. 6 SC in total for the first loop. After the 6 SC hooks, then tighten the coils. Next, hook the second loop in just the first stitch, that is to say, mark the straight S and enter the needle. Hook a sheep stitch. Winding. Bring the line out of straight S, then bring out the loops on the crochet hook all at once. This is a sheep stitch. Hook another CH. Next, hook ASC ink increase STS into the needle at the sheep stitch. Hook ASC first. Still check marking the first straight S. Into the straight S at the ship stitch, hook another SC. This is two SCs on one straight S. That's one SC ink. Then take two SC on the next straight S. The second loop is a total of six SC ink. Ink after the hook, shape stitch at the location of the marking buckle. CH into the needle. Next, hook the third loop. Reship stitches straight S into the needle. First, hook ASC. Remember to mark the button. Next straight as hook ASC ink. So one SC and one ink for group. Six stitches in the third loop.
Next, hook the fourth loop. Ship stitch at the position of the marker. First stitch. Then enter the needle at the shape stitch. Hook ASC. Mark it. Hook ASC ink in the next street S. Hook an SC on the next street S. This way SC ink SC as a group. There are six groups. Demonstrate SC again. Ink. Next, the fifth circle. Ship stitch at the marker. One stitch. Enter the needle at the ship stitch. Start with the SC. Mark it. Crochet two more short stitches in the next two stitches. One ink on one street S. Thus three SCs and one ink as a group. Repeat for a total of six groups. Repeat it again. Three SC. One ink. Next, the sixth circle. Ship stitch in the position of the marker. CH1 stitch.
Enter the needle at the ship stitch. Hook ASC first. Mark it. Next straight is on TKSC. Next straight is up tick and ink. Two more SCs. So two SC and one ink, two SCs for one group. Six sets of hooks in total. Demonstrate it again. 2SC. One ink. Two SC. Next, we'll hook the seventh ninth loop. Ship stitch in the position of the marking buckle. CH one stitch. Ship stitch, hook ASC. Mark the first stitch. Then continue to take SC on each straight S. Rounds 7 to 9 are all 36 SCs. Thirty six SC in the ninth lap. Finish with the shears circle. Mark the position of the ship stage. One stage. Enter the needle at the ship stitch. Start with 10 SC. Go down and take 5 more ink.
six more essays. Five more ink. And then ten more SCs. Next, hook the sheath shizan circle. Ship stitch. A stitch. Enter the needle at the shape stage. Okay, SC. Mark it. And then next, hook an SC on each straight S. 11, 13 circles are all 46 SC. Next, the shoes circle. Shape stitch. One stitch. One stitch at the shape stitch. 10 SCs first.
take five more deck decrees. Threading the needle through the straight S. Bringing the thread out, inserting the next straight S. Bring out the line. Threading three coils at once. This is one deck. Go ahead and take four more decks. Next, check 6SC. Five more decks. And finally, 10 more SCs. Next, take 15 rounds. Shape stitch at the position of the marker buckle. One stitch. One stitch at the shape stitch. Two SCs first. Take one more deck. Hook to SC. Two SC and one deck. Two SC in a group. That's six sets of hooks. Next, hook the Schloss loop. Shape stitch at the position of the marker. Start by checking three SCs.
pick one more deck. That's three SCs in one deck as a group, a total of six groups. Next, the 17th loop, marking the position of the buckle, ship stitch. One stitch. One stitch out of the ship stitch. Start with the SC. Mark it. And then stuff the cotton first. Then hook a deck. And then ASC. One SC, one deck, one SC. Repeat for a total of six groups. Next, the Shabazz lap. Position of the marking buckle shape stitch. One stitch. One SC at the ship stitch. Check her December. SC a deck as a group. Repeat this six times. Nineteenth lap.
one stage. Shape stage. The 19th loop is 6 stack. After the six stacks, shape stitch with the first stitch. Then leave the thread. Cut. And then with a pin, picking the flow of straight S. Perform stitching. Continue. Pick flow in turn. Tightening the stitch. Let's hook the panda's eyes. Let's make two of these. Winding the wire first takes for CH. Next, hook in the second, the penultimate CH, hook ASC, picking up half the straight S of ACH, hook SC. Next, hook ASC. Next straight S again, hook ASC, ink is 3 SCs. And then the next straight S. Put it this way. Let's hook ASC. Pick up the other half of straight S. Then put this thread on the needle to hide it. And then the next street is hook SC ink.
Then we do a shape stitch with the first stitch. And now for the panda ears. Wrap. Loop up 6SC. Tensioning Then ship stitch on the first street S CH one stitch The second loop we hook 6 ink That's 2 SCs on each street S Third circle, ship stitch on the first stitch just made. CH1 stitch. Third loop. It's 3SC and 1SC ink for group. First on the street is of the just shape stage. An SC. And then two more SC. Next street is hook SC ink. This looks like a set of, and then take three, 
three times like this. Okay, third turn, and then circle four. First ship stitch. One stitch. Fourth SC in each stitch. Hook A SC in each straight S. One ship stitch, stitching by long thread. Pull this thread out and then turn it over. Fold it so it's an ear. Let's go down to the stitching. And then this side of the ship stitch is the back side. This side is the front. So the ears first. Pick up half a stitch from the inside out, straight S.
This side also picks up half a stitch from the inside out. And then another half stitch on top of the white. Sewing and then threading into a straight S. Threading from the back. Taking the Tibetan root and then cut this line. And then we'll do the same thing with the eyes. Next we hook the little flower magic ring. Hook to CH. Then hook to DC's double crochet. Wrap the wire around, bringing the line back out, threading into straight S at once, and then two more straight S at once. And then hook in two more CHS. One stitch in the shape stitch. And then repeat this. Repeat this action. Repeat five times.
the last petal. Bring out the cut first. So that we can pull this coil tight. And then pull out the wire. Long wire wrapped around to make the stamen. Then wrap the rhizome in green. Tie a knot. Next, we'll hook the green shoots.
Let's start with 7CH. And then one is C on the penultimate street is. Then next street is down hook ADC. Wrap the thread. Bringing out the wire. Thread the wire through the first two coils first. Wrap wire through the last two coils. Continue to hook ADC in the next street S. Ship stitch on the next street S. And then, 5 more CH. The same penultimate street is on the hook ASC. Next to DC. Where in the next street is for the ship stage? Back on the trunk ship stage two stitches. Stitches brought out. 